I have loved Beauty and the Beast since I was about four years old. The movie came out the year I was born in 1990 and I just fell in love with Belle. She was this feisty young woman who spoke her mind and had all of these ambitions and was incredibly independent and wanted to see the world and was so smart and I loved how she had this relationship with Beast where they were just toe to toe and um, that to me just seemed like such a dynamic and interesting kind of relationship that I'd never seen before in a fairy tale. Oh my god, I was just enamoured with the whole thing. I was just so in love. It was so funny and so romantic, but in a way that, I don't know, for me it didn't feel contrived in the same way that I think perhaps other fairy tales have in the sense that they, Beast and Belle really dislike each other at the beginning and they, they really don't get on and then they form this friendship and then they fall in love and that, there was just something so beautiful about that to me and I've just loved it ever since. As a child you love Disney but as an adult you still love Disney because it sort of connects you with that childlike feeling that everything is going to be okay and there's, there's hope in the world and um, it just sort of, for me, it just gives me this sense of like, ah, oh, everything's fine, everything's fine. So to get to be in, you know, playing Belle and, and to get to actually live in the world is, you know, it's just amazing.